sometimes it doesn't even feel like I'm in class. Um, being able to go outside with my classmates and my professors and just explore the natural world. Having the opportunity to get hands-on work with learning how to manage those ecosystems and promote healthy, sustainable wildlife was something I was really interested in. So we're gonna learn about soil components, we're gonna learn about water, hydrology, we're gonna learn about wildlife and fisheries, and we're gonna learn about vegetation, small plants all the way up to trees. It's a pod of students, and a lot of the courses in the program are sequential. So, you know, you come in with your class, and you know, you're going from this class to this class to this class together, and so you can really develop the camaraderie and uh, the relationships that'll last a long time. The learning atmosphere for forestry is also a unique thing. The classes are much smaller than I've experienced in other areas at Penn State. So it's not just walking in the woods and looking at trees, but you're actually applying the science behind it. For me, one of the most impactful things in the forestry program is the professors and the support you get through Penn State staff. It, it's a small community. Um, your professors, by the end of your four years in the program, will know you on a first name basis. They'll be there to walk you through from the most basic to most advanced questions you have. Typically, people get into the program because they have a love for the outdoors in one form or the other. I have students from I don't want to say it, but 20 years ago, that still call and stay in touch and, and ask questions. For most students, if you, if you work hard, if you've studied well and are knowledgeable about forestry, uh, if you've done a good job of, of networking with people, if you're that kind of a student, you won't have an issue getting a job. I'd like to, within 10 to 20 years, be on a team that's working to slow resource losses from our forests. I hope to use my degree um, here at Penn State, learning about forestry and learning about all the hands-on aspects and apply it to a career in environmental policy. People will always need products of the forest, of the ecosystem. They're always going to need clean water. They're always going to need paper and wood. They're always going to need a place to recreate or to get away and be quiet. And so uh, knowing how to manage them for the future uh, is just critical for all communities, all people.